Today I wanted to show you the kind of framework that we plan to use for our Vacation Bible School backdrop. This year we're using group BBS's Kingdom Rock as our theme. It has a castle theme and we're planning on using a, some stands that we do ourselves similar to this, perhaps a little taller, to support the foam 4x8 sheets that we'll paint up to look like castle walls. Those 4x8 sheets of foam will have cutouts for doorways. Here we have one and a half inch Schedule 40 PVC. We have 90 degree elbow connectors. Tees, 45 degree elbows, and our VBS uh, has had a cross piece before. It's not essential, but since we have it, we're going to reuse it, and I'll show you more in detail in a moment. One of the things that we often do when we, to reinforce our PVC connections, is we will use a one inch drywall screw screwed in to the PVC. You can see we've used this last year. The nice thing about the, the drywall screws is that they're short enough and pointy enough that they're not hard to drive at all simply using a standard drill and a number two Phillips bit. To cut our PVC we're going to use simply a skill saw, although you could use a hacksaw the power tool will get it done a lot quicker. To connect uh, elements to our PVC framework, we plan on using this 9 or 10 inch zip tie. It will go around the PVC, connecting our foam core or foam board to it, and give enough uh, extra length that you can work with it we think that the 7 inch, 6 or 7 inch zip tie was just too short and too hard to work with. The other thing that I recommend that you use after you cut the PVC is simply some fine grit sandpaper to get the rough edges off to make your connections tighter. We're back outside now looking at the details of our framework. Our vertical support that we're showing is a six foot piece of PVC. We'll probably do it seven or eight feet, but these were easier to work with today. We have a cross connector, a four foot horizontal piece. The bottom is a T with two two foot connectors that give it stability. I wanted to show you how we're using the cross that we already had, and that is to put another two foot piece in, or any length that you want. We've wrapped it in a piece of brown paper, and we've uh, taped a flag to it. So that will give it a little bit more decoration at the top. Also, to make our backdrop curve a bit, we're coming out a very short distance and using a 45 degree angle connector and we would then shorten this piece this horizontal piece of PVC to make the overall distance to the edge where we have a 90 degree angle but we want that run horizontally to be four feet because that's the width of our foam board. 